Alright guys, so I just recorded a 35 minute commentary, like 35 minutes of just me talking and listen. I don't know what your deal was, but basically I thought he was Kobe Bryant. The like mic. The right? mic. Super shy. It recorded with the wrong mic. I cannot believe it. Just listen, just listen. Oh my god. Guys, that's the first time this has ever happened to me. Literally recorded 35 minutes straight. It was a great gameplay too. I got a quad feed. I uh, fan had a trick shot actually. And the whole story was perfectly told. But it recorded with the stupid Logitech mic. Which on the Logitech program it says mic, razor, siren. But it still recorded with the Logitech mic. And who knows now. It could be recording with the Logitech. I told a story that happened to me in middle school. And... Like, sure, I don't mind re-saying it all, but it was literally perfectly told, and it was 35 minutes straight of recording, just all gone to waste, so now I have to redo it, and, oh. But yeah, I'm basically gonna be doing the cut combo without the gameplay part, because I had already, like, turned off my Xbox, I was getting ready to, uh, edit it, and I have to hang out with my friend in, like, 30 minutes, like, it's, it's all bad right now, I don't know what's gonna happen. <laughs> but yeah, I hope you guys don't mind if there's no gameplay in the background, it's just gonna be me talking. First off, I wanna start by saying I've missed only three uploads in the past month, and a little bit over a month, so... That's actually a huge accomplishment for me. Um, just about two or three months ago, I only uploaded like once every two days or once every other day and just videos weren't my first priority, but now everything has changed for the best and I really hope you guys are content with that. By content with that, I meant like content with all the consistent uploads and stuff because I found a new schedule basically. I wake up, eat, and then I try to make a video for, oh my god, I just spit, I don't know if you saw that, but <laughs> I basically try to make a video for hours and hours up until it gets like 5 to 6 p.m. where it's like a little too late to upload and that's when I basically just like say okay I'm done but usually I get a video done and when I do miss uploads sometimes it's either an emergency or I just um can't get it done like I'm like way too busy with other things but yeah I haven't talked about jerky XP in a, in a while because their website was actually down and like they had a lot of issues with their old website but their new website has actually launched if you guys want to check it out it'll be at the top of the description um their beef jerky is actually super super good I never really liked jerky until jerky XP came into my life and they have all these different flavors and it's just super good and you can also use code RUG at checkout for a discount. Guys, like I'm actually still furious about what happened. Like as you guys can see in the beginning of the video, I showed you guys my editing program and like the mic quality. Like <laughs> the only reason why I'm mad is because it says the mic was Razor Siren. Like I usually check that every time before I make a video. I even checked it before I even started that commentary and it said Razor Siren and it just recorded with the Logitech. So even right now as I'm talking, I don't know if it's recording with the Razor or with the uh the logitech mic which would suck if it does it again and i would just not upload today because <laughs> i'm in such a rush now actually too okay well on to the awkward middle school story so basically there was a super super cute girl in middle school her name was caroline and i talked about my rival in high school um his name is john but i talked about him in a video before i said he looked like kobe bryant and he got me an autograph it was fake and stuff so He's a part of the story, just keep that in mind. John and Caroline. So I was a shy little guy in middle school, like, if you guys can't tell, like, you guys think I'm young now. Imagine middle school, just picture that. I actually have a couple pictures, but I don't want to show you guys. I actually had long hair, too, like, down to here. It w I just looked super funny. So yeah, middle school relationships are completely different than high school relationships. Like, some people write notes, letters, like, text messages, I don't even know, but... So I had a super big crush on Caroline, and... I actually wrote her like a love letter. Uh, I expressed all my feelings onto this one little piece of paper. I wrote this letter because I was too nervous to go talk to her in person and like all that stuff. So, so Caroline was in the same PE period as me. She wasn't in the same class, but she was in the same PE period. And John was actually in my same class and period. And we also had like three or four other classes, which is stupid because we just hated each other throughout all of middle school. But yeah, I guess John like overheard me talking with like a lot of people that I like Caroline and stuff. And, um... I was planning on giving her this letter during PE, by the way. So it was PE time, and all the teachers had taken attendance, and we all, got, it was basically like a free day, like we all got to play football, basketball, anything we wanted, and I spotted Caroline, went up to her, and I gave her the letter, and I'm like, uh, here you go, uh, don't read it now, just read it later, and I just like walked away. So as I'm walking back to my group of friends, um, I turn around for like a split second, and I see John talking to Caroline. And at this point, I'm thinking, oh my god, please don't know that I just gave her that letter, because he will do something stupid, but 
Yep, I guessed right. He literally took the letter and started running. Literally took the letter out of Caroline's hand and started running. And I start chasing him for like five to ten minutes. I couldn't catch him. I don't really want to consider John as a bully, but like he didn't like punch or anything, do that. But he was just like he was just like mess around with me all the time. And he was bigger than me. I, like I said, I looked like a super. Like I looked so so young in middle school. And um, yeah, I was basically chasing him for like five to ten minutes and. Uh, I gave up and I'm like, you know what, if he was smart, he wouldn't do anything with that letter, like, I trusted him basically. So about 20 minutes passed by and I'd keep on looking at John every like 2 minutes because I'd have him in my sights while I was hanging out with my other friends, he was hanging out with his friends, he didn't really do anything with it, he would just like kind of like flash it at me, he'd be like this, like from a distance, you know, just picture that in your head and... I was like, oh my god, this is so fucking annoying. So Caroline was actually with a group of friends, um, and I knew all those friends too, like she was just like hanging out with them. And I see John walking up towards them and I'm like, dude, stop. Like, he's not going to do anything stupid. So Caroline was with about like 10 people and I, I did know all of them. There were about like two guys and then the rest were girls. I see John unfolding the paper right in front of them and about to read the paper. And I like literally sprint towards there. And before I got there, it was too late. He started like reading all the things. Like, think about it. My love for this girl was on this piece of paper. Like, if I remember correctly, some of the things I had on that paper were like you're on my mind 24 7 like just middle school love relationship stuff you know what i'm talking about it was so so embarrassing right when i got up to the group like as i sprinted up he was like already halfway through the let not halfway but like a quarter in and like they were all just like laughing and stuff and i go up and i just literally run back like i'm like oh my god my life is ruined so this dumbass john basically just read my love for this girl in front of her and my group of friends too and like just her friends and it was super super embarrassing so, like when i ran back to my group of friends i still i kept like glaring over there and they were kind of like looking back at me and like kind of laughing and stuff like that the next day comes and caroline actually came up to me and she's like oh i thought the letter was sweet and stuff but i'm not really interested i'm not really looking for a boyfriend now but it was really sweet so i mean i, I was good with that I, don't, I didn't really care but she thought i was sweet and my other <laughs> my other friends were messing around with me they're like, oh you should be a poet when you're older like that they, they would always bring this up in funny situations so honestly after that day i didn't talk to john for like two or three months and even when we did talk it would just be like arguing we would never talk as friends because we were never friends i just hated him he hated me i guess we were just rivals and thank god after middle school we we both split up like he went to another high school and i went to a different one so we were good after that guys i'm still pretty mad about this whole mike situation because when i told the story um, while playing COD and stuff the first time like it was told so much better and I like with more detail I just really couldn't like think about this like you guys record a 35 minute commentary and it was super good I know I did a good job and I was super happy with it put in the editing program heard the mic was fucked up like I, I just turned into a bad mood after that but I still tried explaining it as best as I could but yeah that basically wraps up today's video thank you guys so much for watching um again if you guys want to check out the new jerky xp website you will not regret if you buy jerky xp you will not regret it at all like i said you can also use code rug at checkout for a discount and other than that it's been rug drop a like if you guys did enjoy and peace